Hi, I'm Stuart and welcome to Sign Up Television. We're going to take a look at a brand new pre-install that we're about to start working on. There's a bit of a story behind this and basically what's going on is this is a community service vehicle for a sheriff's office and they asked if we could help them out with some lighting equipment. So we've agreed to do so. We don't do it too often but in this case we've agreed to do it and it's a brand new Ford van and we're going to take a look at that particular vehicle and then we're going to take a look at the equipment that we're going to put into it. So let's go check it out. Okay, here we are inside the vehicle and we've got the uh, switch box of course clearly put into position. That's of course the Cyanet switch box with the three position slider and relevant buttons. Then on the outside of the vehicle we've got a variety of different light heads. We've got our GL2 series mounted in the grill there flashing away nicely. Plus of course some ghosts as well as vertexes which we've mounted low down in the vehicle. On the sides of the vehicle, I also went along and dropped in some additional Vertex light heads. And on the roof, we have the LBL1 Sirenet light bar. This one happens to be in red and blue configuration. We also mounted vertexes on the hood area there, as you can clearly see, flashing away in red and blue, and also on the mirrors. A little bit of an angle there of the vertexes flashing off the ground as we move around to the rear of the vehicle. On the rear of the vehicle, we did put in some additional lighting, and that included some Lindsay Sixes, is the ones in question around the number plate area there that you can clearly see. And a close look there at the ghosts mounted on the hood, and that'll also definitely assist in traffic clearing. The unit itself also has an additional siren amplifier unit mounted inside as well as relevant components pertaining to the siren speaker. They're all mounted inside the engine compartment. A little bit tight to get stuff into this particular vehicle. But I do believe this vehicle will start to see a lot of service throughout the U.S. in the coming year and coming years as well. So a nice vehicle produced by the folks over at Ford. And as we move up the uh, rear door area, we also put in some of our new GL3 series light heads, as well with an additional amount of GL2s mounted on the back door above the GL3 series. Again, they get the vertexes firing away comfortably in the grill area there, as well as on the side, so giving nice intersection protection. Very potent lights, all of the configuration, I must say, on this particular layout. Very pleased with it indeed. Well, there you have it. This is the Sirenet install, and the gang did a tremendous job on the Ford Transit van. I'm Stuart, and you've been watching Sirenet Television.